Hi guys, it's Ariella, and in just under two weeks, I'm going to be a first year medical student. So I wanted to come on here today and start a series of shorter videos about specific interview questions and ideas for how you could approach each one. And I think that separate from a video about the interview itself, because that's a whole different thing that requires a lot more planning, how to approach the interview and how to feel comfortable. But today I just wanna talk about a specific question and then continue to do more specific questions in future videos. A quick little disclaimer, if these recommendations don't fit into your application, don't try to force them in because inconsistency in your application can actually look worse for you. So with that out of the way, today I want to talk about why osteopathic medicine or why DO. And with that, I also want to talk a little bit, just a little bit about what is osteopathic medicine because it's possible that if you're applying to DO schools, they might ask you because they expect you to know what's the difference between an osteopathic school and an allopathic school. Allopathic, like your typical MD. All right, so the first thing I recommend to approach this question is know a little bit of the history about osteopathic medicine. And this was actually recommended to me by a DO physician that I shadowed. So back in the 19th century, there was a physician named Andrew Still, um, not super important that you know his name, but he was unhappy with the way traditional medicine was working, and so he decided to create osteopathic medicine, which focused on the body's innate ability to heal itself. The functional difference is osteopathic manipulation therapy, or OMT, OMM, whatever, there's a bunch of different names for it. You should know that MD schools do not have OMM, and DO schools do. Hey guys, so I realized I never actually gave a good definition of what OMM is in the video, so I just wanted to talk about it quickly right now. OMM is a technique used by osteopathic physicians where you use physical manipulation of the body in order to diagnose, treat, and prevent illness. Okay, back to the rest of the video. Other differences include a focus on primary care and a focus on local care. And I think as the shortage of doctors becomes more and more apparent, this will be true of MD schools as well. So when I was answering the question, why am I applying to osteopathic medical schools? I had a few things in mind. The first thing that I thought of was the fact that in the future, I want to work in potentially an underserved area because I'm from an underserved area and I wanted to give back to a community like my own. With OMM, I have an additional tool that an MD might not have in an area that's already hurting for medical care. A second consideration was that I've also shadowed a lot of DOs in my community. This gave me an introduction to osteopathic medicine and showed me how it's different from allopathic medicine. In addition, there's a lot of osteopathic physicians in my area because there's a school really close by that funnels osteopathic physicians down here. I also considered that I had physical therapy experience, so I worked three out of my four summers in undergrad in physical therapy, which gave me more exposure to the physical healing of the body. The last consideration that I had was a passion for physical health via lifestyle changes. So I was and still am very passionate about diet and exercise and making these small lifestyle changes to impact your overall health and your health in the future. And so this was another consideration when I decided I also wanted to apply Ideo. So another question you might get along the lines of why osteopathic medicine is why did you apply to both osteopathic medicine and allopathic medicine? In my case, I shadowed both DOs and MDs and there are both a lot of inspiring DOs and MDs in both my community and my family. So I had exposure to the field already. All right guys, so those are all the tips I have for that particular question, why osteopathic medicine. Uh, if you have recommendations for other common interview questions or if you would like to see a video about the entire interview process, let me know and I can try and make that. All right, bye guys.